but it is best understood by analogy with music. Because music, as an art form, is essentially playful. You say you play the piano, you work the piano. Why? Music differs from, say, travel. When you travel, you are trying to get somewhere. And of course, we, because being a very compulsive and purposive culture, are busy getting everywhere faster and faster and faster. So we eliminate the distance.
you were able every night to dream any dream you wanted to dream. And that you could, for example, have the power within one night to dream 75 years of time. Or any length of time you wanted to have. And you would naturally, as you began on this adventure of dreams, you would fulfill all your wishes. You would have every kind of pleasure. what you would dream. And finally, you would dream where you are now. You would dream the dream of living the life that you are actually living today.
God what the self is. You have to remember that it doesn't need to remember anything. Just like you don't need to know how you work your thyroid plan. So then, when you die, you're not going to have to put up with everlasting non-existence because that's not an experience. A lot of people are afraid that when they die, they're going to be locked up in a dark room forever. And they have to sort of undergo that.
childhood up, we have had to conform to a certain social game. And if you're going to conform to this game, you can make mistakes, or not make mistakes, and so on. This thing is done into all the time. You must do the right thing. There's certain conduct appropriate here, there's certain conduct appropriate there. And that sticks in us, and gives us a double self all our lives long, because we never grow up.
You want a surprise. You don't know what that's going to be. 